Yo, what's going on guys? Boy, we're here back on the Madden 17 and today we got some gameplay for you guys. This is actually the last gameplay I have with this team that you're looking at right here. The team has changed immensely since then. I feel like every time I do a team update, I just change my team dramatically. I don't know why I do that every time, but my team is completely different from this. I'll get you guys a gameplay with that team as soon as possible. But first, I want to get a gameplay with the team that I showed you guys before. So this is the go team I'm going up against. Definitely a team mismatch. I feel bad for this guy, but I played it. I played a team even worse. The guy's best card was a 77 overall Tom Brady that you got from doing like solos. Like a, I don't even know, but it was completely unfair. And I actually. You guys might think that this is stupid, but I actually blocked him, so I won't have to play him again. So, in retrospect, he may be a fan, so I'm sorry if you're a fan, but I blocked him. That way, I'll never have to play him again, because that was bullshit. The matchmaking in this game is so broken. So, usually, whenever I play against people with like horrible teams like that, I'll just block them. That way, I don't have to play them again. It's right here. I'm coming out with a screen, second and ten, and we're able to fight forward with Keenan Allen. I started running wide receiver screens a little bit more often, because they are pretty good, as we get Keenan Allen going in the middle of the field. Uh, spoiler, I actually got rid of Keenan Allen, because he pissed me off. It might actually be in this game, or the next game but uh he dropped like I, i'm looking back at like i wish i kind of would have kept him because i do like keenan i was right there hitting deandre hopkins in the seams and then i'm actually going to come out in almost the same play i see that there's no one in the middle of the field you guys can see that no one was in the slot over hopkins so i audible to verticals i snapped into it to him right away he's gonna come out in a counter and completely fool me i thought he was gonna be running a power to the right side i was fooled and uh here he is coming out on a screen on the opposite side he's doing a pretty good job of confusing the shit out of me second and six he's running a play action and he's hitting underneath i think my controller like fucked right there because you guys can see i went straight down and then he's gonna truck the living shit out of me and then dive into the end zone and i think that was the luckiest touchdown ever but of course he had to dive in and celebrate and then i'm gonna run it with derrick henry can't get anything going with him but he is fighting forward god damn was he trying hard to fight but he ends up losing three yards at the end of it he's trying to feed derrick henry again but all we're gonna do is make it third and nine i'm gonna no huddle out of pure aggro here to be completely honest skipping ahead and look who we got open in the middle of the field we got limited use deandre hopkins man i'm missing that card a lot he's an absolute gun but here we go with with fucking mariota dude look at the good ball look at him go mariota he misses the strip he's down to the dead and he's walking in untouched man diving into the end zone that's the base gold marcus mariota dude i gotta throw him in every once in a while and give him a fucking carry because he makes stuff happen dude excuse my french i'm sorry i'm swearing a lot but dude, I, that's so, I love doing that, man. People just get so it just throws them off so much when I do that. Third and third team, everyone is dropping back, looking over the middle of the field, threw it over my user. I feel like I, Brian Urlacher probably should have intercepted that after it bounced off. Fourth and third team is going with the Doug Peterson conservative call, and it's actually going to go in his favor. Is right there. I looked absolutely stupid. He got that truck animation, and then I just completely whipped my tackle. And we're going to be able to chase him down, though, from behind, and we're going to cause him to end up just, just running it in the very next play. No problem. So I'm going to get the ball right here out of half. I'm trucking the mother and fuck out of whoever the hell that was with Derrick Henry. So I'm going to run the ball again with Derrick Henry. I'm going to try and truck again, but I'm actually going to get stood up, making it a gain of about seven. Second and three, dropping back. None other than limited edition DeAndre Hopkins. And none other than him not being able to catch. If you guys can see, I actually have Marcus Mariota still in the game. I forgot to take him out. So you guys can see when I come out in the formation, I actually had Marcus Mariota in this whole drive. And you guys can see, he's throwing dots. I was wondering why I was taking so long for the balls to get there. And as I was editing i was like oh that's why and look at that he's another dot limited edition limited use deandre hopkins man mariota actually had a pretty good drive right there to be honest that was actually kind of crazy that was mariota the whole time he trucks the living fuck out of me with his derrick henry dude and he's got 10 seconds left just about right here and he gets that glitchy animation dude he's going to be able to take it all the way Sammy Coates, and he celebrates, of course, even though I think the only time he scored so far has been on hot bullshit. So it's 21 to 21. It's just an absolutely like tit for tat game. He's coming out in a screen. That time I probably should have been picked, but they don't give me the interception. But he's going to end up losing six yards, man. Second and 16. He's dropping back, looking to the right side of the field. That probably should have been picked off, too. But Khalil Mack let it go right by his face for some reason. Second and 10. He's coming out with a counter again, but we're right there, just like we were doing it before. You know, he ran the play the first to play of the game, so we decided that we're going to lock it up this time. He's coming out again, same exact play as he did the first drive, but we're going to be able to shut it down at third and 11 he's coming out in the same exact formation he's dropping back looking over the middle of him and they go again and we got julius peppers and he's got to get the fuck out he's gonna go ahead and throw his xbox out the window and hit the fucking eye quit and i'm a goddamn bitch button so if you guys like this video then make a like comment subscribe follow me on twitter gonna be on the description below i'm gonna hit you guys with gameplay of that team that i built so stay tuned for that as always peace